Welcome forward to Hot Talks Live with your man on the stand, your therapy, Ken to the Solomon, your blessed one right here. Of course, this program brought to you by Portland Cover of Credit Union, moving ahead and serving you and you and you better, even picking in a brown brown. This segment, of course, we do have another big artist from What's the Verdict 96.1 Roots FM, Aya Hingi. Of course, you got the International Song of the Year online. Remember, me tell you that for the year. 2011. Welcome to the program. If thanks for the opportunity. Bless the Lord. Thanks for having Aya. Yeah, yeah, man. Aya. 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 Aya yeah, to man. the Indy. No for percent. See? Yeah, man. Everything turn up and sound boy. Sure. Why not? See? Mm -hmm. it is. Of course, Aya Indy. Of course, how oh, you come by this name? First of all, Aya Indy. All right. Aya Indy is actually a term derived from the original term, Naya Bingi. Okay. Yes. yes. So you know, Naya Bingi is the highest order in Rastafari highest concept. Order. Yeah man, it's Rastafari. the highest order in Rastafari concept. But actually, so, what a lot of ones don't know yeah. is that Naya Bingi is more of a female affiliation energy because oh, it's an ancient nice. word from outside of Africa okay. and it has a female essence to it. The yeah. man is a teacher, yeah. the so, man is a teacher, so don't it? I have to forward and say, yeah. I as a man, yes, I is I am Ingi. Yeah, you know that Naya Bingi originally means dead to black or white, don't press her. Don't press her. Yeah. Yes, yes. So yeah, it only really means yeah, every father don't press her outside. Love that. that. You know what I mean? What's your correct name that your mother gave you? Well, the correct name that my mother gave me is Yilme. Yilme. Yilme? Yeah. Yilme? Yeah, man. That's the first name? That's my yeah, first that's name. That's last name. Williams. Yilme Williams? Yeah. Hmm, that's kind of a, a strange name. It's a, a new name to me. Yeah. I don't need to yeah. get that in at all. No, it's an original, it's an African name, you know? It's an African name. Yeah. Means well, may he live. Let's it's get to your music part of this thing now. Um, sure. The song that you got, International Song of the Year, on, on the line, what's the title of that song? Well, the title of that song is called World Crisis. You know? World Crisis? Yeah, because you know... Tell me a little bit about this song. Yeah, well, World Crisis is an energy where I am just looking in the global affairs, things yes. that's happening all yes. over the world, yes. and yes. we just analyze and assess all of them things that we see are going Mm. From Africa yes. to Asia, Asia, the Middle East, yes. here in Jamaica, in this oh. diaspora, we can't right. leave it out, you right. know. So right. we just look at all the things that happening, you know, the behavior of all the world leaders. So that inspired you to write this song. All yeah. those stuff inspired yeah. to write this song, and this uh, song becomes a, a big international song. Yeah, man, because it's an international really message. Yeah, international in message. It. Yes, that's so, it. And you have the music video and all of that for this song. Well, the video is not completed as yet, you know. Not yeah. as yet. No. Not as yet. Oh, yeah. yeah. So you're working on it. Yeah, man. How did you start the music business? Well, you know, as Bob Marley said, started out crying. <laughs> so music is I like that. You started out crying. Yeah, music yeah, well, yeah, life, yeah. Man, from ever since. You know? Yes, I love that. Yeah, but mm. professionally, when it comes down to writing and recording, it's really 1999 that I started out with a band called Aluta Continua. They are not really together anymore still. Okay. Where did that band originate from? They originate from here in Kingston, you know. In Kingston? Yeah, yeah. man. In Kingston. Kingston. We used to do a lot of rare salon by a studio. Kingston likes to work with me twice. Yes. Kingston, Kingston and New Kingston. Kingston and New Kingston. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. From the start in Kingston, we have to big up all the Kingstonians today. Yeah. Larger for the same, larger than Charles. See, they're tuned to. Hard to watch live with your man on the stand, Ken Solomon. Aya Hingi is inside the building, of course, the international song of the year. And what's the verdict online 2011? Big thing to this artist coming up this year. Watch out for Aya Hingi. Of course, yeah. Aya Hingi, we'd, we'd like you to, to just tell us a little bit about um, your back, little bit about your musical background. You know, yeah. um, the biggest thing that happened for you and, and some of the things, the things that happened that you never liked in the music business, like you went on the stage and you, you never liked the performance or something like that. Yeah. Just to name a few. Well, alright, you see my musical journey still as we said started out in 1999, but most of the influences where I get is like from the 12 tribe organization because yeah. my father is a member of the 12 tribe organization. Oh so yeah, your father is a yeah, wow. he's currently living in Ethiopia as yeah, we man. speak, you know, because you know the 12 tribe organization is a global organization where they have members yeah. all over the world. All over the world, yeah, four so. corners of the world. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I mean, Charlie and the road with my father in them time, they used to get 
exposed to the real foundation mm -hmm. part of the music. Mm -hmm. And my one of the um, foundation sounds called Jalove. 